Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do a review on these switch shields. So we're gonna put this over a switch and see how it does. Now there's two levels of protection. You can put this over a switch and you can leave these tabs installed or you can remove these tabs. I'm gonna do it both ways. I'm gonna show you, you can remove the tab. You're simply gonna just bend it and it breaks off right there. Just bend it back and forth, this little tab. Now I can get, the, it prevents you from uh, throwing the switch on and off, but now I can get my finger in here and do the switch. If I leave the tabs installed, you can still, you gotta use like a little screwdriver to throw the switch. Okay, so here's my switch plate. I've got an outside light that it's controlled by my Amazon device now. So I'm gonna guard it in this position here. So I'm gonna take these two straight slot screws all the way out. Okay, so here's what the screws look like. They should be long enough, but if you need a longer screw, these are a 440 screw, so go to a hardware store and tell them you want a receptacle or switch cover 440 screw. Okay, so I just put the switch guard over the switch. Now you put the screws in and we're gonna tighten the screws down. Okay, so here's what it looks like installed. I can still see the switch, but I can't accidentally hit it. So if I come in here and turn this one on and off, I'll know that in, and if somebody else tries to turn this one off, they're gonna be like, oh, he probably wants that in a certain position. But since I took that tab off, I can get my finger in here and I can throw that switch very easy. But if you don't want that somebody to be able to get a finger in there, just leave that other tab on. I can also take that tab off also. I'm going to leave that tab on and use just this side. So it seems very well made. I'm happy with my purchase. Thanks everybody for watching.